Okay, tonight's little video, it's gonna be nice and quick, but it is about licorice. And licorice is something that I've never really been into. Um, there's two things growing up that I just wasn't into even as a kid, and that was marshmallows and black licorice. Just not a fan, uh, hated the licorice flavored uh, jelly beans, you know, around the holidays and all that, but just, I've never been a fan. Until recently, I have found two products that have changed my mind on both black licorice and marshmallows. I'll talk about the marshmallows in another video, but this first one is a Dutch licorice. And if you know anything about licorice, you know the Dutch love their licorice, apparently. I mean, that's coming directly from their, um, <laughs> their website. And they make all different types. The type that I have just fallen in love with is this, it's made by Venco. And it's a Dutch chalk shape licorice. And it reminds me of Good and Plenty, made by Hershey's. These are the uh, the little pieces of uh, licorice here, and that's just a candy outer shell, right? Very, very similar to the uh, Good and Plenty's that we're all familiar with. Uh, you know, the, the purple and the white uh, licorice that's out there in the States. But this stuff is crazy good. There's something different about it. I don't know what it is. Maybe I've just had crap licorice my whole life. I don't know. But this stuff is amazing. I mean, it's kind of, if I had to describe it, yes, it's licorice. Okay. I'll give it that. It's black licorice, but it's, it's kind of buttery. It's got a nice mellow taste. The, uh, the outer shell, which does look like chalk. That's why they call it a chalk licorice. Um, isn't like too sweet. Uh, I know they sweeten this with sugar and molasses, according to the, uh, the ingredients on the back. And I found this at World Market. So if you have a World Market near you, it's not that expensive. I mean, it's like four bucks a bag. And um, it's crazy good. They also have the salted licorice, if you've ever heard of that. I, I've tried it in the past, like the little Scotty Dog salted licorice. I think that was Dutch as well. Um, I wasn't a fan. It tasted like I was trying to eat a belt that had been left in the ocean for a hundred years. I just, you know, I just wasn't into it. But this, this chalk licorice, I have gone through, this is my fourth bag, <laughs> I think. And to have not liked licorice my whole life and to finally find um, some black licorice that I really enjoy has been surprising to say the least. So yeah, you can find it at World Market for about four bucks. Try it out. You might run into there the salted they have a heavily salted licorice, which I did buy a bag and tried. It was terrible, um, in my opinion. <laughs> they had a light, lightly salted licorice, and uh, it was a little bit more tolerable. But my favorite so far has been this chalk-shaped licorice by Vinco. Uh, again, it's a Dutch licorice. It, you can find it at World Market. I did see it on Amazon, but they want like $10 a bag or something crazy. So if you can find it um, cheaper than that, I would definitely get, I wouldn't spend 10 bucks on this bag of licorice. I mean, it's good, but it's not $10 good. So uh, anyway, nice, quick, easy little review on some, uh, on some black licorice. Hope you enjoy it if you try it. Let me know actually in the, in the comments if you try it. Or maybe you know of a licorice that, that is even better. I know this is kind of a, a, a boring little video, but I wanted to get something done nice and easy. So. Um, Nice and quick tonight, so. Venco brand Dutch chalk-shaped licorice. It's crazy addictive and good. Thanks, guys.